I'm Chris Berman. Coming up on ESPN, we'll take a trip across the Hudson to East Rutherford, New Jersey, and come ashore at Giant Stadium. Dan, Peter, and Susie are standing by for the call in what shapes up to be a most interesting matchup. Minnesota Vikings, New York Giants, now. While the teams are out on the field getting loose, the fans are filing in and finding their seats for the game. Hi, and welcome to Giants Stadium. I'm Dan Stevens. At my side, my cohort, Peter O'Keefe. Peter, our game features one of the best wideouts in the game. Unquestionably, Dan. He's a dominant player, but will he dominate today? Okay, we'll keep our eye on him as the game progresses. But first, the coin toss. It's tails. Number one, kicking off for the Vikings. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Giants football. Number one kicks it off to begin the game. Number 17 fields it all the way back at the four. Breaks the tackle. Drag down at the 31. Number 17 was able to find some weak spots in the defense. Got a good run back off that kick. The Giants will start this drive at the 31 yard line. Number 86 goes in motion. Number 26 takes his first carry of the game and maybe picks up one on the play. He's got such a vice-like grip, Peter, it's got to be hard to break out of his grasp, even when you're one of the uh, slipperier runners. Absolutely. Jones throws the bullet and it's caught at the 35. The Honey Jones has some size to go with that arm. 6'5, 230, big numbers. Who needs an O line when your QB is the size of a defender? Lock him down. Third, Third three. down, three wideouts in the game. 38 yard line. Number 26 the handoff and is dropped short of the marker. Fourth down coming up. Number 53 just planted the ball carrier in the turf short of the markers. But the only thing that's going to grow there is the D's yeah, morale. The defense is back is against the wall formation. and they rose to the Number challenge, four. Peter. Make yeah, Dan, that's great D. They had to make a stand here and they stood together. It will be fourth down. Number six gets the ball and punts it away. Number four fields the punt at the 18. Stopped at the 20. Number four didn't have much room to work with back there. The special team squad made sure he couldn't respond to that really nice punt. The Vikings get their offense on the field and will start this drive at their own 20 yard line. Number three goes in motion. The sack at the 16. Number 58 goes in unlocked and nails him to the ground. The O-line should be embarrassed. Watch this. Oh, yeah, sacks don't get much easier than that. Peter, they put an end to that play well in the backfield, and they had a real good read on that. Yeah, it all starts with the guys up front, and then everybody follows. Second down coming up. Oh, let's watch this. Five wide out versus a D that is wisely loaded up on DBs. Number 15 throws a beauty to the right side, and Holding. it's tipped. Number 31. Incomplete. Defense. Five-yard penalty, automatic first down. Number 31 tries to contain his man on this play and ends up holding him. That's going to draw a flag. Let's watch. Oh, yeah, easy call. Defensive holding. Here comes the count. 
First and ten. Ball at the Vikings, 21 yard line. Ball and is well past the markers for a first down. Yeah. Good job. Number 18 goes one on one on this play and beats his man. He executed that pass pattern perfectly and made the catch. Nice reception. Nope, they could not cover him man to man. He was one step ahead of the defense. Watch the counter. First Watch and the ten. Counter. Ball at the Vikings, 39 yard line. <laughs> Picks up about two, and that will bring up second down. Second down and four wideouts in the game. Vikings, 41 yard line. Four receivers line up as the defense settles into a nickel package. No dice, and it falls incomplete. Number 15 throws a heater right side and First it's caught at the 47. Finally stopped at the 47. That will bring up first down. Number 87 snags Number the dart right sideline and picks up four Number on the play. With the tackle. Gun, gun. I see two. I see two. Number 28 <laughs> takes him down back at the 45. Number three catches first it over the Vikings. middle and they get the first on third and long. Number three does a great job here battling three defenders. It's definitely worth a second look. Let's watch. And he still comes up with the ball. Wow, you can't coach that. A beautiful pickup, Peter. Everyone on the offense is happy about that play. Definitely great call by the offensive coordinator. And it will be a first down. Him way sack. back at the 31. Number one gets to his man in the backfield for a big loss. I don't know what happened to the protection. Let's have a look. You know, Dan, it's all about focus and persistence. He was not going to let that quarterback get that pass off. That'll be his first sack of the game. Down the floater, out left, and that's oh, a baby. touchdown. Two drop, two drop for you. Check it out. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. <laughs> Number 15 gets this one past the secondary quite easily. I, I think the safeties were out of position on that one, Dan. Now that kind of accuracy is hard to cover, Dan. He knew where he wanted the ball to go, and that's where it went. Peter, he'll add a touchdown to his stats, and he has to be very happy with that. You bet. Big cool. play, my friend. Not the extra point. Kenny Holmes holding. Now the point after, the extra and point is good. it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Number one rockets this one deep. Number 13 decides to take it out of the end zone. Breaks free. Tackled at the 22. Number 13 took it out of the end zone. And while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20. So it all comes out in the wash on that play. The Giants stalled early last drive, and we'll have to wait and see what happens here. They'll start at their own 22-yard line. 
number 26. We'll get the carry on first down and maybe picks up one on the play. Number 26 used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. And I'll tell you what, this looks like it wasn't that difficult to tackle, but he had his hands full. Yeah, looks can be deceiving, Dan. He really had to square himself perfectly to make that play. Number 82 didn't haul that one in, and it falls incomplete. Dahani Jones threw an incomplete pass into double coverage. He's got to use better judgment out there. If complete, that would have made for a bit shorter third down play, Let's but not tall. much. Not a lot up. of potential on that call. Jones uncorks this to the left sideline, and it's tipped. Incomplete. That will bring up fourth down. Number seven came in and got a hand on that football and left no quarter. chance for a reception there. Well, the knee holds Boy. tight on third and long Boy, and forces stop. an incompletion. That was a good call Boy. by the defensive coordinator. Boy, it sure stop. was. Perfect D for that situation. Stop. And it will bring up fourth down. And that'll do it for quarter number one. Vikings are out in front, seven to nothing. East to West. Number six gets ready to punt this away. Number six takes the long snap and punts it away. Number four gets it at the 34. Tackled at the 39. Number four got swarmed by the kicking team before he got very far. That nice punt pretty much goes unanswered. The Vikings had an effective first drive, and we'll see if they can keep it up. They'll start at their 39-yard line. Number 18 goes in motion. Number 15 wipes it out left side, and the ball is caught for a gain of seven on the play. Number 15, he's showing off some precision passing out there, Dan. Clearly, he's exploiting the short game so far, and he's got 91 yards and one touchdown. Second and three. Ball at the Vikings, 46-yard line. Number 33 will get the carry on second down and will end up losing a couple. Number 97 not only cleaned the ball carrier's clock in the backfield, but buffed and polished it too. Big hit for a loss. You can't slalom around him like a downhill skier would, Peter. He's going to swallow you up. You've got to be a cross-country skier that time to get around him. He is a load out there. Number 15 throws a heater and it's tipped. Incomplete. It'll be fourth down. Number 28 managed to disrupt things. He got in there and he smacked that pass away. Great deal. It seemed like the defense read that one from the beginning and they forced the incompletion with Ronald of Eve. Beautiful call by the D coordinator. It'll be fourth down. Number 14 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 14 gets the snap and puts it away. Number 13 heals the punt the at play. the 15 down at the 28. Number 13 did a nice job getting some yards after fielding the solid punt. The Giants have had some trouble moving the ball recently. We'll see what they do on this drive as they start at their own 28-yard line. Number 26 takes his fourth carry of the game and gains Number about three yards. The ball carrier. Number 40 with the tackle. Second down Second with the tight seven. end right. Ball at the Giants, 31-yard line. Number 80 
86. Bubbles and drops it. Incomplete. Number 86. Number 86. Muffed an almost guaranteed catch there. And as a receiver, the you have to carry your weight and make the play. They don't come much more catchable than that one. The incompletions keep piling up. Let's and even this. here in the 17. second quarter, it doesn't seem to be improving. Not at all. They're just not getting it together. The timing, the routes, the protection, nothing. Jones fires this oh. one over the middle. And it's complete. Short complete. of the markers, however. That Number will bring up fourth down. Number 22. Brought down the ball carrier before Let's the markers. Number there six. was some game there, but not enough for the first. Number they allow four. a little there, the but they do force a fourth down. Way to attack the ball. Number six. Lines up for the punt. Number six. Takes the snap and punts it away. Number four. Takes it at the 26. Tackled at the 36. Number okay, four, did a nice job getting some yards okay. after fielding the solid punt. The Vikings are looking for some separation before half and will start this drive at their 36-yard line. Number 95 gets the sack way back at the 30. incomplete. Number 15 zings it to the right side and it is not reeled in. Incomplete. Number 18 had some room on the fringes there but couldn't reel in the pass. Peter in third down situations they have not been successful at all with the pass. This play was more proof. Boy, third is such a crucial down game. And when you don't convert, it really hurts. Number 14 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 14 takes the snap and punts it away. Punt down at 10. the 41. Number 13 racked up a few yards on the run back there, whittling down the size of the punt a little bit. Giants offense comes out and has an opportunity to tie it before halftime. They'll start at their 41 yard line. Number 86 goes in motion. Jones floats it to the right side and it's incomplete. incomplete. Number seven was Number the man seven. on that the play coming receiver. across the middle, but Number the ball couldn't find him. Incomplete. Potential for some nice yards, but it falls incomplete. That will bring up second, second down. down. Ball at the Giants, 41-yard line. One man to beat. Eventually slams down at the 42. First down. Johnny Jones does a little last-minute razzle-dazzle here. And he gets some yards. Peter, it doesn't even seem fair when your quarterback can run like he can. Yeah. And that's what makes this guy so dangerous. Good coverage, good pressure, but still, no one could corral him. Number 86 goes in motion. Jones throws a lob here, and it is not Passes reeled in. Incomplete. incomplete. Number seven. Number seven. Didn't have receiver. anybody on him, and yet he couldn't Number make the catch. Potential the for a quick first down, but no, they cannot hook up the pass. You can take a shot in that situation, and it's really not going to hurt you. That's a good call. Second That'll ten, bring ten. up second down. Ball at the second down, ball. both tight ends left. Number 26 will take the handoff and Game heads left. Tackled and the clock will continue to run. Let's take it up and Third and five. Take it up. Ball at the 37. Down. 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 
Jones throws a bullet here. And it's knocked Passes away from incomplete. the receiver incomplete. Number 86 was the intended receiver. Number 21. Number 21. The coverage. And man coverage and played it pretty tight. Tight enough for the incompletion. It seemed like the defense read that one from the beginning, and they forced the incompletion with relative ease. Beautiful call by the D coordinator. It'll be fourth down. Give it up, Pop Number six. Number six. Lines up for the punt. Number four to make the return. <laughs> Number six takes the long snap and kicks what will be a short <laughs> one. Number four, Fair catches it at the 14. The Vikings have a long field ahead of them and start this drive back at their own 15-yard line. Number 33 chews up four yards, and that brings up second down. Okay, fellas, with the we know it's all we can practice. Now we're going to get it this time. Now we're going to go just like it is. We're going to execute, okay. we're going to stay strong, and we're going to get to the spots we need to. Okay, fellas? Second, Second down, two five. wideouts on the field. The Vikings, 19 yard line. Number three, didn't haul that one in, and it falls incomplete. Number 15, knows how to spread the ball around, as you can see by this passing chart. He's getting the ball into his receiver's hands, and has piled up 91 yards and one touchdown. Get in the ball's path. Nice. That's how you make the INT, baby. Boy, that was a heads-up play to come away with his first interception of the game. Yeah, you got to love D like that. The Giants. Offense has taken the field, and they have been having a very tough time passing the ball. They have another opportunity here as they start off at the 30-yard line. It's intercepted. Breaks a tackle, gets out at the 21. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, man. Number seven, that's why you think twice before throwing a pass in his neighborhood. Watch. Great presence of mind to try for the football there. Boy, that was a heads up play to come away with his first interception of the game. Yeah, you got to love D like that. The Vikings were intercepted last time out. We'll see what happens here. We'll start at their own 21-yard line. Number three goes in motion. Number 15 throws a high, long one to the right. And it's off. Incomplete. Number three, was the intended Number three ran a quick hitch Number on that last play. Didn't coverage. quite work out. Incomplete. Potential for a quick first down, but no, they cannot hook up the pass. You can take a shot in that situation, and it's really not going to hurt you. It's a good play. That'll bring up second down. Second down with two tight ends to the right. No dice, and it falls incomplete. Team passes a high and long first run down and Vikings. it's complete. The Vikings ball. take their first time out. Come on, Giants, let's play some D. Oh, God. First down, first one man back. Ball at the 45. Down. 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 Down.
Keeps it away on the coverage. Incomplete. Number 28. Came in and got a hand on that football. Left no chance for a reception there. A nice defensive play will give him his second batted ball of the game. Yeah, great read there. Second and 10. Ball at the 45. Number 15 lobs this one over the middle, and it falls incomplete. Third down, 10 yards to go. Didn't haul that one in, and it falls incomplete. Fourth down coming up. Number 18 got open on that last play with a slant route, but couldn't bring the ball in. Peter, well, I tell you, he, he seems to be in a bit of a funk recently. Yeah, I mean, you know, that's his fourth ball thrown his way, and, and he can't reel them in. Yeah, funky, Dan. He's just got to grab one to get his confidence back there. Number 14 gets the snap and names this one out of bounds. This will fly out of bounds at the 12. Number 14 did a good job angling the punt out of bounds, so the offense will start off stuck inside the 20. The Giants' offense takes the field with the clock at 11. Number 52 hammers the receiver and forces him to drop the ball incomplete. Number 22, closed in from the zone and forced the incompletion. That had potential for some yards, Peter, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Number 82 goes in motion. Unloads this to the right sideline, and it's tipped. Incomplete. Number 21 came in and got a hand on that football. Left no chance for a reception there. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. Third down, three wideouts in the game. Number 26 rips down the lob. And And that'll do it for the That's first the half of, of this one. Quarter. The Vikings are out in front, seven to nothing. And now let's send you to Chris Berman in our studios in Bristol for the ESPN Halftime Report. Over. All right, Dan, interesting game at the half. We'll get back to you guys in a bit. First, we welcome everybody to our ESPN Halftime Report. I'm Chris Berman. A look inside the numbers from our first half and look at the discrepancy in sacks thus far. The Giants should be way ahead on the scoreboard, but somehow they've let their opponent hang with them. Let's see if they can change things in the second half. We'll start this one off late in the first quarter. Number four is going to find an opening in the secondary, and he'll exploit it here. A 31-yard touchdown for the Vikings. The Vikings get the first points of the game and go up by seven. Giant midway through the second. Donnie Jones let his big old offensive line pave the way on this one. The Vikes late into the second quarter. Vikes winning by seven. Number four shows some great awareness here as he gets himself into position to pick this one off. The Giants have it off an interception. Number seven was in the right place at the right time as his interception was a possible momentum shifter. Giants behind seven to nothing. Number 87 is on the receiving end of this one. As on third down, they decide to go for the jugular. And that's where we'll leave this one. Giants are waiting for their first score. They're down seven to nothing. It's time now for our Halftime Hero Award, which recognizes the most dominant player of the first half. Duh. This time, there can be no question. Number four has been unstoppable. So that does it for our Halftime Report. We'll send you back now to the second half of this one. 
Dan Stevens and Peter O'Keefe are there. Gentlemen. Thanks, Chris. And today's game has been presented in ESPN Game Sound, designed and developed in collaboration with Dolby, the leader in surround sound technology. The Vikings will receive to start the second half, and they currently Number enjoy nine, a small lead, giant. seven to nothing. Let's get down to the field and the action. Number four decides to take out the end zone. Stop at the 20. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. Not a lot of action in this one overall, but even though they're in good shape, a single score can turn it around. They have to stay focused here. Susie Culver is down on the field and has some information for us. Susie? Thanks, Dan. Head coach Mike Tice talked to me during the half and he said he was proud of the way the defense had locked down the field so far. On the other hand, he said they looked a bit sloppy on offense. He really wants them to come out strong, execute well in this half, and try to get this game out of reach. Back to you guys. Susie, thank you. Number 98, blast him back at the 16. Number 15, rifles this one hard over the middle. It's intercepted. Interception. Interception. Start at the 25. <laughs> Number four, puts the football back for a little gain after he picked it off. He was hoping for more, but, you know, he'll take it. Peter, you couldn't ask for more from him today. He has done his part. And then some. So far, he's got two interceptions. The Giants are going to try and capitalize on the interception. They'll start this drive at the 25-yard line. Number seven catches the lob over the middle, and he's in for the score. Touchdown, Giants! Johnny Jones launches this one perfectly, and the D was nowhere to be found. You got that right. Missed coverage all around. That's right, Dan. My six-year-old could have covered that pass. That touchdown will cut it close, Peter. That was a big play. Way to stay in the game. Here's the extra point, and... The extra point is good. good. Set. Number nine booms a beauty here. Number four downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Vikings have been locked in a defensive struggle so far. They will start this drive at their own 20-yard line. Number 32 picks up about two, and that brings up second down. Number 33 used the blocking, but this stingy defense didn't give up much at all on that last play. Not second much there. Eight. It'll be second down. Oh, Got to take what you can get, Dan, but they were, they were hoping for more. Incomplete. Number four. Had some room on the fringes there, but couldn't reel in the pass. If complete, that would have made for a bit shorter third down play, but not much. Well, maybe even a little shorter. There was there was some room to run there. Number 17 goes in motion. Number 15 throws a bullet to the flat, and it's tipped. 
Incomplete. It'll be fourth down. Oh, yeah, baby. Woo. 25. Okay, yeah, baby. Came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception. You know, as a team, they are batting down passes left and right. <laughs> that is their sixth so far. Wow, great anticipation of the pass. Number 14 lines up to punt after the three and out. Number 14 gets the ball and punts it away. Number 13 punts it at the 42. Of three on the play. Tackled hard at the 44. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. Look at how many times they've had to punt it away. They've got to put a few longer drives together to get into the end zone. Number 13 got swarmed by the kicking team before he got very far. That nice punt pretty much goes unanswered. The Giants bring their offense on the field and will start this drive at their 44-yard line. Jones just this one and it's caught at the 49. Brought down hard at the 44. It will be first down. Catches the left sideline, and complete. that will be good for a game of eight. With the tackle. Dahani Jones threw a perfect pass back there. You know, I had a better shot at it than the defense did, and hey, I'm up here second in the booth. Two, Peter, what a nice pickup to get them into a second and short situation. Yeah, great play, and now they have a bunch of options on what to try next. Second down, two tight ends in the game. Number 26 has his number called on second down and picks up the first down. Number 86 goes in motion. Number 52 makes a play on this and forces the incompletion. Number 52 swatted that one away cleanly. The receiver didn't have a prayer in getting that one. That had potential for some yards, Peter, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Ball at the 31. Cracks him down back at the 34. Number 24 was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. Nice job eliminating any forward progress on that play. That will bring up a third and long. Third down, one man back. Makes a play on this one and forces the incompletion. Fourth down coming up. Number 21 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. That is their fourth batted ball. Tell you, we've seen a number of good defensive plays from this squad. We sure have. We'll see if they can keep it up, though. Fourth down, and the field goal unit is on the field. Number 9 launches the 51-yard attempt and... Barely misses this no one good. off to the right. Number nine misses the field goal here. Let's watch this again. Yep, it's just a little bit to the side of the upright, but close only counts in horseshoes. The Vikings will start this first play of the drive at their 41-yard line. Number 18 catches it in the flat and is First at the 50. Like Finally dropped at the 42. First down. Number 18 doesn't let a little thing like double coverage stop him from snagging the football. Another short catch, and that's where they've been utilizing him today. Yeah, the short routes have been open, and he's been exploiting it. First down with the tight end right. Number 15 throws a lob right sideline and it's tipped incomplete. Face mask, number 28, defense. Five yard penalty from the spot of the foul. Number 28 Repeat held the face down. mask back there, but it was kind of iffy. That's a five yard penalty and a right call. First and five. 
Ball at the 37. Number 84 goes in motion. Number 22 steps it away on the coverage incomplete. With the Number 22 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Another batted ball, and they have been attacking the pass every chance they get. That's right, Dan. Second you know, why five. simply defend the pass ball when you can obliterate it? Number 33, choose up four yards. Strip. That will bring up third like down. Like Number four, brought down the ball carrier before the markers. There was some gain there, but not enough for the first. That's his second tackle so far. Third down from the eye. Number 33, gets the call again and converts the third down. First down, Vikings. First and ten. Ball at the 30-yard line. Number 33 carries it for a third time. In the road and he takes it upfield. Chase down at the 20. It will be first down. First down, Vikings. First and ten. Ball at the 20-yard line. Number 33 gains three yards, and that will bring up second down. Number one with the tackle. Pass is going over second and seven. Ball at the 17. Number 33 takes it off the top and heads up field. Tackled at the 11. Number 33 can thank his blockers for that last play. If it wasn't for them, that play would have tanked. A decent That's play, the and the they'll now quarter. face third and short. That's the key, Dan. Make third down easy, and they did just that. Now they just need to convert. We'll see what they do. So three quarters in the books now, and we're all tied. Okay, bring him out. Bring him out. We got the change. No first, baby. No first. No first, baby. No first. Break down, baby. Oh, Woo! Man. Yeah, baby. That's how we get it. What's the pass? First and goal. Ball for nine. This pass, and it's caught for the go-ahead touchdown. Yeah! Let me get wicked on you right here. Number 15 makes a terrific completion in double coverage here. Wow. Now that is one confident QB. Another touchdown pass, and he's finding the end zone here. Absolutely, Dano. So far, he's got 151 yards and two Number touchdowns. To attempt the extra point. Kenny Holmes holding. Here's the extra point, the extra and point is good. it's good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Number one kicks it off. Number 17 fields the kickoff at the two. Right down at the 24. Number 17 got a very respectable return off that nice kickoff there, Dan. All right, man. Cool. Okay, let's do this. Let's do it.
Giants had their last drive stall out at the end. We'll see if they can keep momentum throughout this one, which starts at their own 24-yard line. Number 26 gets the call on first down and gains about three yards. I'm bringing it all day. Number 26 just hasn't gotten into a groove and isn't finding running room anywhere. This has been tough, and he struggled to get 17 yards on eight carries. Second down, Second just a six. single receiver on the field. The Giants, 27 yard line. Jones fires this one over the middle, the and is it is not reeled in. Number incomplete. Was the Hunting Jones receiver. winged it into double Number coverage, but luckily was coverage. nobody was able to catch it. Those mid-range passes are not working out for them so far. Let's Peter, we got Third and what's six. different in that range? Well, the, well, the coverage and yards. their reaction time. The D is beating them to the punch right here. <laughs> Number 93 gets the sack the way sack. back at the 22. It'll be fourth down. Number 93 gets the sack deep in the pocket. That's going to be a sizable loss. Watch this. Oh, yeah. That's going to push him back, way back. Great defensive play. Peter forced the loss of Yardy John third, and, and now they face a fourth and long. How, how do you Number rate four. that Make defensive performance? Uh, how about A+, plus? two thumbs up, five stars. It's all good, baby. Number six gets the ball and punts it away. Number four heals the punt at the 36. Drag down at the 45. Number four, did a nice job getting some yards after fielding the solid punt. The Vikings, offense Minnesota. takes the field with time winding down. They'll start at their 45-yard line. Number 33 takes his 13th carry of the game and probably gets back to the line of scrimmage. Number 33 had some blocking help on that last one, but he was still left with nowhere to go. And there's a situation where he just made up his mind that the play had gone far enough. Yeah, and he was outmatched, too. Second that was nine. all desire. Ball at the Vikings, 45-yard line. Number 15 throws a bullet to the flat, and he's on target for a gain of five. Number three was getting double coverage there, but it wasn't enough to stop him from making a catch. That's broken kind of a cold streak for him. The last two passes his way were incomplete. Yeah, let's see if he stays on track. Quick outside pass on that last play by reading it perfectly. No catch, incomplete. Peter, the defense stood tall and forced the incompletion, but I don't understand that call. Uh, they wouldn't have gotten much at all, even if it was complete. Fourth down either way, and in my opinion, too, a bad call. Number 14 takes the snap and punts it away. Number 20 gets it off the bounce at the two. Number 20 is going to get under one gorgeous, stupendous punt here. Look at this baby. Reels it in and then can't get far before he's dropped. Perfect job by the special teams. Great kick, great coverage. The Giants find themselves in dangerous territory and will start this one way back at their own five-yard line. This pass will fall pass harmlessly to the ground, and it's Number incomplete. Seven was the intended Number receiver. seven didn't have anybody Number on him, and yet he couldn't make the, the catch. Not much success to be had on the right side for this passing game, Peter. They have been off over there. Yeah, I'd go Second somewhere else if I were there. Ball at the Giants, five-yard line. Jones zips it to the left side, and the catch is made at the 11. Touchdown. 23. That will bring up first down. 
First down from the shotgun. First down, both tight ends left. Giants take their first time out. First down, the clock is stopped at 156. Slides down and the clock keeps ticking away. Second down, six yards to go. Number seven makes a play on this and forces the Number incompletion. The deflection. Number seven came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. They have really gotten after the ball as a team today. That is their fifth Third batted and ball. Six. Nice, aggressive D. 41 yard line. Jones throws this on the wall. And and the catch is made for the first. The clock continues to tick down. First down, first and this is the seventh play oh, of the drive. And the clock will continue to run. That will bring up first down. First and ten. Ball at the 30-yard line. Jones floats it to the right side and it's tipped. Is incomplete. incomplete. Yeah. Number 44 came yeah. in and got a hand on that football and left no yeah. chance for a reception there. You know, as a team, they are batting down passes left and right. <laughs> that is their sixth so far. Wow, great anticipation of the pass. Second and ten. Ball at the 30-yard line. Number 40 makes Passes a play on this and forces the Number incompletion. The deflection. Number 40 came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Another batted ball, and they have been attacking the pass every chance they get. That's right, Dan. You know, why simply defend the pass when you can obliterate it? Third down. The clock is stopped at 59. Jones throws a beauty to the right side. And this one is incomplete. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. You should have gone for the field Fourth goal, and ten. Shotgun, Ball shotgun. at the 30-yard line. This one falls incomplete, and they will turn the ball number over on down. The intended receiver, number 44, with the coverage. <sighs> number seven has this one in his hands, and then oh, drops it. They had the right idea there, going for it, trying to put the ball in the end zone, but they couldn't convert. It was the right time to roll the dice, Dan, but this time the house wins, and they turn it over. Not a lot of time to get the job done, but they can stop the clock three times with their timeouts. Loss of one on the play. That'll bring up fourth down, Dan. And while it's a big play, the clock still ticks on. Another 40 seconds will roll off the clock here. Go 
number 14, gets ready to punt this away. No sign of hurry from the offense. They're going to take it slow here, Dan. They're concerned with one thing right now, and that's the clock. Number 14 gets the snap and punts it away. Number 13 catches it at the 30. Tackled at the 33. Number 13 didn't have much room to work with back there. The special team squad made sure he couldn't respond to that really nice punt. The Giants start this drive of the game from well in their own territory, and the clock at four. Jones throws a high long one to the right, and it's caught at the 48. Eventually tackled at the 43. Number seven had three guys covering him, but look what happens. Incredible catch. And Peter, if you were looking at this matchup on paper, mm -hmm. you'd figure that this would have gone the other way. You betcha. He's given away a few inches in height, but he's still able to get those arms up and pull it in. And that is going to do it for this one. The Vikings come out on top 14 to 7. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying goodbye until next time. Okay, Dan, thank you very much. And let's welcome all of you back to the studio. I'm Chris Berman here to bring you our ESPN video games post-game wrap-up. The Vikings stepped it up for sure, putting up some good numbers. Let's get started in this one early in the third quarter. Number four would come up with the big play to kill a drive as he was able to step in front of a wayward pass for an INT. The Giants have it off an interception. Ball at the 26. Donnie Jones would drop back and deliver a strike on this one. A 25-yard touchdown for the Giants. The Vikes, after a missed field goal, game tied, seven all. Number 15 needed to be on target here, and he was. Number 86 ran a terrific route here and was able to pull this one in. Giants down 14 to seven. Donnie Jones connected with his man on this one. And that's where we'll leave this one. Vikes edge out a win, 14 to seven. Now let's check in with our player of the game. A guy who made one big time catch after another to help seal the win for his team. Number four is standing by with Susie Calvert. Suze? Thanks, Chris. You were fantastic. You may have the ingredient your team needed to pull out a win here. What made the difference for you guys to come out triumphant today? Man, to be honest with you, I really think someone's looking out for us today. We're just blessed to come up with this win. I'm just very happy and thankful that we come out on top, and now we have to look to keep on moving forward. Back to you, Chris. That winds up our broadcast of the NFL preseason on ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports for 25 years and counting. I'm Chris Berman. Thanks for joining us.